Hello there everyone on the internet. In the previous video we built this Facebook clone website and in this video we are gonna host this website for free using github pages. This is a Facebook clone that we built in the previous video and in this video I am gonna show you how to host this website for free using github pages. So for that we need obviously we need to go to github.com slash new. So we have to create a new repository so I am gonna go directly to this um, web address and if you haven't created any github account yet then create one is completely free and you are gonna need it a lot so most of the time you are gonna need it and in here I'm gonna be providing the repository name and underneath it I'm gonna provide some description this is a clone of facebook website using sorry this should be using html and css only and after that uh, you just wanna choose if you want to have the public or private repo for now i'm going to choose public because i want to host this website using github pages so let's choose public and underneath it we need not to do anything so just create repository and it's gonna create one repository for us let's wait for a second and if you are a geek that knows uh, how to use git and github then you can just use the command line otherwise i'm gonna show you some shortcut so here you can see that you uh, you get the option of uploading an existing file just click here and you get this face so either you can just click here and add your files or you can go to your files this these are my files uh, this is my index.html um, style and here I have some images that I use in this website so I'm gonna select all of this and just drag this all and drop them in here and it's gonna upload all the things here so our files are being uploaded here okay it's completed now and you need not to worry about any other thing just comment change just click in this green button and you are done with creating your repository okay this may take some minute is saying okay our repository is created now we can proceed publishing this uh, website using github pages so i'm gonna go to settings here just go to settings tab and in here just scroll a little bit and you will find here the pages so come here select pages and you are gonna get these all the things so you need not to worry about any of the things just follow what I say just choose here the main branch yeah you by default it's gonna push into the main branch so choose main and you need not to worry about any other thing just click and save and it's gonna host our website using this github pages and my website is ready to be published at this web address so let's click this or open this in new tab and currently it's saying site not found cause it needs a minute or two minutes to host this website actually so let's check this after a minute now let's open up this link i hope we got our website running in the internet so we got our website running in the internet and that's it we got our website published on the internet so here is your web address or url you can just copy this and share with your friend and that's it uh, just just a quick comparison here we have our local file and here you can see that it's saying local or share file and in here saying it's just saying the asispanthi.github.io that's the subdomain provided by github to my username and that's it 
and here we have this one this uh, whole little thing and here we have same thing so we have successfully hosted our website and it's pretty fast i think yeah this website is pretty fast and github pages is one of the best hosting provider out there remember while creating a new repo you have to choose public otherwise uh, i don't think that you can publish your website using github pages if you have private repo so that's it for this video that was a quick tutorial and showing you how you can actually host the website using github pages and be sure if you haven't watched the previous video just go and watch the previous video it was really exciting and fun and it was really long also and i'll catch you up in the next video